hello viewers welcome back to my channel in this video i will teach you how to cut and sew this lovely veil you can see how beautiful it is so if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe like and share my video and tap that notification bell so that you can be notified when you upload new video let's get started these are the material we need we need five years or two minutes 15 yards of this, a yard of this, or you can get it from your lace fabric, any comb. So these are the things we be using. So these two nets, so these five yards of two nets, so it's usually by 60. So this side will be 60 inches, and the other side will be number of yards. That you got the five yards. So you take you fold it into two, you fold it in length, then you fold it in breadth. So you have four layers. You fold it into two, then you fold it in into four. So that's what I'm trying to do. So I'm using this so that you'll be able to see what I'm doing. So this not five yards. So this just a yard. So be, but if you want yours to be as big as the one in the picture, so use five yards. So I'm just using this as particle. So let the mouth meet. I see the way let it to lay very well. After laying, just make sure that. The mouth means so when you can't, it should have four layers. So, after that, you take your table, this is your table to measure eight inches, just place it from that angle to so this side. Then you can see the shape, you shape it out. Just follow the way I'm doing it. This enables you to have curved shape so that you have sharp edges. When doing yours, ensure that the net lays very well so that you have equal sides. So when you open it, you have something like this. You can see, the, you can see it is curved. So the other side too has this shape, this essence of it. So after that, you take your You take this, you place the right side on the net, place the right side on, on the net, then you sew it once. So I told you you need about 15 yards of this, you need 5 yards of 2 nets, and 15 yards of this will be enough to sew it on. So when you sew it, then it will turn like this, so she, she has something like this. After sewing it, it's, you hold it this way. You start from one angle, then you take your table to measure one a yard, measure a yard, that's 36 inches. From that, on that 36, you make, you can see the way I'm holding it. 
so you plate it make sure you plate it and run a stitch on it you run a stitch on it after placing it run a stitch on it so you just use that seat to tack it down then you take your comb you can take you can use gum the candle gum or any other gum available then used to attach the comb to the two mates so you can decide to cut the the net but in this tutorial i won't cut the net so if the bride will put on cap so you don't need to attach the comb just make a stitch then use safety, uh, safety pin or office pin to attach it to the cap of the bride so look at this i cut out the the yard a an inch yard i cut it out so you can decide to cut it out before you attach the comb so i'm just trying to teach you another method of making a veil you cut you cut when you measure 36 inches then you cut it out then you sew it you place the one i mean a yard and the and the four yards together like this then you do your pleats you make just make the pleats then you make a stitch on it then you attach your comb so it's either like way so this is how you stitch the trimmings with the two nets you can see it's i place it on the two nets Just sew it by half inch. And sew it. And this is how you attach the design on your lace. So you can pin it. Use office pin to pin. Then you turn gently. I see the way I'm doing it. This is how you do it. Just sew it. Be careful not to sew your hands. So, hi right, guys, if you find this tutorial helpful, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like and share my video, and tap notification bell so that you can be notified when I upload new video. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See my next tutorial. Bye.